Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Soldiers. Last time we left off, we beat our first, like, big boss, I would say. I don't really consider Dark Lance a big boss. Um, and I think what I want to do this time, I have a lot of extra time today. So, uh, I think what I want, what I would like to do is kind of go back through this area and see if I can find the two soldiers that I'm missing, possibly. And, um, just, just see if I can maybe get some of these treasure chests or something, like, maybe do something about this, maybe this is actually a thing. Because I'm still missing quite a few treasure chests here, so, I don't know, may maybe there's some way to get these that I just didn't see. So I would like to try and get those, since they seem like the important chests, so. I think I'm just gonna run around, kind of investigate things, and, uh, whenever I see something worth- worth showing, um, I'll show that. I'm not gonna show me completely, exhaustingly exploring this entire place. Uh, but yeah, I think it'd be good to show, and good to do. Okay, I'm down here at this treasure chest. Um, I have done a lot of walking, and have found... basically nothing, so I basically went... here, down this way... Um, I went down this way, looped around here, checked out all of this stuff, checked that out. Um, I obviously haven't went up there yet. I went back down here to this water to make sure there was nothing I missed down there, or I couldn't, like, change element to get through the water somehow or something. No dice. So that's basically what I've done so far, and now I'm over here, and I'm staring at this treasure chest like, how in the nine hells? I don't see a way to get it. I- it really feels like I need a double jump, or a higher jump, or... some sort of movement ability, an air dash, anything like that I believe would get it- get me it, but... I don't see a way to do it right now, so... Onwards, we're exploring. This thing annoys me, because it looks like I'm supposed to be able to get down there, but maybe that's where the water links up to? It pisses me off, alright? And that's what- that's- that's all I wanted to say. It annoys me. Doesn't seem like I can get this cheeky bastard, either. Maybe I should just leave this alone for now. I- I've- I haven't come up with, like, anything. And it's already been 20 minutes. And I've gotten a resounding nothing. Usually the good thing to do in Metroidvanias is just to come back once you have better stuff anyway, because it's easier to traverse the areas, and... Yada yada yada. Maybe I should just do that. Um... I'm gonna go check back on this thing, because it says there's a locked door over there. I think I recall not needing that locked door, but I want to check on it anyway. Oh, hey! Whoa! Whoa, 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 you're, you're infected with the thingy. Where did you go? Huh. Wait, does that move into- does that thing move into, like, a different enemy? Whenever I kill the one? Because the soldier had it, and now it was in that. Or is that just a buff that random enemies can get? I'm not sure what the deal with that is yet. But yeah, that was like the little purple wisp that took over that dead soldier. And now it was in a random bat over here. Wait, there it is again! What? Now it's in this stupid slime! Okay, it went away. What in the hell? What was with these things? And why is it- why is it here so much right now? I don't know. Why- why this room in particular? Oh, this was just one of these walls. Oh, well that's boring. Oh, but wait, there's a treasure chest under it! Okay, so I should blow him up anyway. Okay, I didn't think about the possibility of there being a treasure chest in the damn wall. Okay, well that's good to know. Alright, well at least I got something out of that. I'm not really sure what to use that stuff for yet. But, uh, hey, that's something. Okay, okay, I can at least say this stupid, stupid endeavor bore a fruit. Not some fruit, but a fruit. A singular fruit was born from this. Okay, cool. Alright, let, let's just- let's just get our happy little, uh, mage asses out of here, why don't we? Um, let's go back to the antechamber. I also don't think I can get up to that place. It really feels like I need a double jump or an air dash, or something. And this is a Metroidvania, so that would make sense. Those are the abilities that are usually given to you. So... It bums me that I can't find the other two soldiers. Um... 
If it ever becomes too much of a problem, like if I come back here with more abilities and I still can't find their asses... Because there's probably, like, one up there... There might be one down there... Um, there could even be one over here as I'm walking up there... You know, but if I come back with more abilities and still can't find their asses, then... I may seek some assistance online, because this is a big area to explore, and I just explored... a pretty decent portion of it, and didn't find shit, so... But alright, now we know blow up walls even if it looks like you don't need to blow up walls. <laughs> Good to know. There could just be treasure chests hiding under them. I thought it was just a shortcut that I could open. You know? But no, that was not the case. Um, anybody hiding around here? Could really uh, use a soldier to save. Would really, really enjoy a soldier to save, actually. But, uh, it doesn't look like we're gonna be getting that. Looks like we are leaving, so this is my next objective. There's that area over there, but... I don't know if that's a side area, or if that's an area I'm going to come to later. There's also still three of those things left. It says we've only been through 70% of the map, to be fair, in this area, so clearly this zone is kind of massive. So I think once we get the ability to, you know, go underwater and stuff, I think that will probably help out there. We still have 30% of that area unexplored, so that must be where the final soldiers are. Excuse me? Hi? Sky, why are you talking to me? Mufasa, is that you? Leandris. Leandris answered my call. That was the Valkyrie? Yeah. I'm here, my lady. Leandris, we have been made aware of some unusual beings recently appearing around ter across Terra Gaia. Do you mean the humans? Human. Oh, those humans. I'm aware of the phenomenon that has brought them to Terra Gaia, but these beings are not our concern at this moment. They were cut off inside that dome, which is why we appeared. But not made it clear that I have no interest in the humans. I speak of the other soulless beings. I understand. Should we act? No, for now, be cautious and watch them closely. As you wish, my lady. Alright. Okay. Weird sky. Sky person talking. Road to heaven. Excuse me, why'd the music stop? Music was playing for like a second. Okay, there we go. I was <laughs> like, where's my music? Oh. What a pretty background. What a pretty background. This is a very weird thing. But when I was a kid, I remember playing Sonic, and I would always stare at the things in the background and be like, Ooh, I can't wait to get to that place. You know, like that mountain range back there. Like Sonic was an open world game or something, and I could just go there, or the next level would take me there. I'd always just see the things in the background and just like, think up levels that could possibly take place at those locations. Just one of those weird things you do as a kid when you, you know, you don't understand how video games work. So it's like, it just made too much sense to me, though. I think it was like Marble Zone or something. I saw ruins and stuff, and I was like, I can't wait to go to those ruins. That'll be so cool. Hello. It's like the regiment inspecting the Western Caves finally started to come out. I wouldn't have gone in there for anything in the world. Yeah, you're one of the... Uh, whoops, sorry. Um, I wanted to finish your dialogue. I didn't know you were still going. Uh, yeah, you're one of the, like, convict people, I think. Give me a break. You've, you have gone whenever you were ordered. Wherever you were ordered. I suppose. Who am I, Aladdin? They find me. They find what we were looking for? Not what, but who? Some kind of god of, on Earth, but they were only monsters. Oh, wonder what it looks like. Okay. Nice conversation, you two. Yeah, I think they were called, like, Slayers or Reapers or something like that. Ex excuse me? Adorable, like, fox slash wolf hammer brother? I don't- I'm sorry. You're very cute. I kinda didn't want to harm you, but you were attacking me, so... I don't really have a choice. Really digging this music right now. It is cool to be out of, like, the... cave and actually be in, like... You know, an open... world. Well, not, not open world, but like, a, a place open to the sky, is basically what I mean, because we're back on the plains again. We've been spending a lot of time in that spider cave, so it's cool to... Gonna be out here again, you know? I'm in- I'm into it. Can you not? Hello, dork. You want some? Uh-huh. Okay, you have, like, helm splitters with your hammer. 
interesting. The other thing I like about this is there's little room for secrets here. It's kind of straightforward, so I don't have to feel like I'm constantly missing stuff. Which is nice. Is this a bomb of a wall? I don't think it is. Usually they're marked, but we have seen sometimes they're not marked, so... You know. Alright, so... Go over here. And see what we got. What's up? Okay. Oh my god, Braviary, please. Or Talon Flame. Whatever strikes you fancy. Having uh, ranged attacks definitely makes you a little bit easier to deal with. Um, destroy all the fruit? I'm not sure if there's a reason to, but I'm going to do it. Uh-huh. Whoop. Nope. None of that, please. Dead soldier. Oh! Okay, wow. That thing flew straight at me. So you can throw them in, like, a straight line. Uh-huh. Whoop. None of that. Uh-huh. Dead. Yeah, I don't think that's anything I can blow up. Eh. Okay. I wanted to see what would happen if I destroyed all the fruit. The answer is not much, in case you were wondering. It's gonna be weird to know how long I've been recording this episode, because... Well, I ran around for like 20 minutes, so technically this video is probably like 11 minutes long at the moment, because I didn't really put anything in. Not very much. Hi. Welcome to my personal space, bird. How dare you use sky attack on me. Quit that. Or are you using fly? Okay, I was about to say, what is this? I can't attack it. Is this doing anything? You're like, it's, yeah, you're like taking damage. Bomb you? No, that did nothing. It's not doing damage numbers to you though. What is that? Okay, it is marked on my map, so I don't have to worry about keeping track of it. Okay, I guess we'll come back maybe once we have some context for whatever in the world that is. Yeah, it's marked on my map, so it's clearly something important. Inescapable hit. Stay alert. Oh, wow. Okay, that's weird. Usually games have unblockables, but I've never seen inescapable. Stay alert. If you see an enemy attack flashing yellow, you can't avoid it by dodging it. By dodging. You should block it or run away quickly. Okay. Thank you for that. Uh-huh. Good to know. Oh, okay. Go ahead and swap to that. Damn it. Uh-huh. Whoop. Okay, yeah, so you gotta jump it. It's a it's a ground slam, that makes sense. Uh-huh. Can I throw that at you? Yeah. Whoop! Damn it, I tried to jump there. Nope. Okay. I don't have health potion, right? I do not. Oh my god! I really didn't think you would hit me from there. <laughs> I was sure I was safe. <laughs> but that golem was like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> I was sure I was safe up there. I was so confident. Oh boy. What a doofus. All right. Well, I guess I'm gonna re-get all of this stuff. All right, um, this is where the golem was. Yes, okay. So I think I'm gonna drink one of these and go in here and just wail on you. Oh, gotta, gotta switch back to this. Whoop, no you don't. Okay, so I can't actually dash through you. That is something interesting to note. You gonna do the, the ground slam? No, not yet. I guess uh, that critical hit thing didn't last very long at all because uh, I don't see it. Uh-huh. Oh, there we go. We killed you. Level up. Cool. Yeah, I just realized I probably got a lot of XP running back through the old areas. I don't, you know, know how important that is or anything, but, uh... <clears throat> I was killing enemies as I was walking around and stuff, so we have one Mastery Relic. I'm totally maxed on that stuff. I think the one I would want to go towards next is... This. Use the power of Burst if your staff is fully charged. Yeah. Think I want to go for that? Maybe? 
I don't know. Um, I was gonna say something. What was I gonna say? Um... My brain just died. It's fine. Whatever. I gotta say, though, playing this and Cuphead at the same time was a mistake, because, um... My special attack and dodge buttons are reversed. <laughs> Which is awful. In Cuphead... Uh, in Cuphead, Y is dash. Or, like, dodge. In this game, that does that attack. And, um, in Cuphead, B is your special or your EX move, and in this game, it's dodge. So that's, um... That's gonna screw me up. Uh... Are you marked on the map? You're not. Eh. Oof. I wish I could leave a marker for you. Whatever, I'll probably be back here at some point, because I'm gonna go back towards that weird treasure chest, right? So... Ooh, secret. Finally, me walking into a wall like that actually did something. Okay, wow. Excited to see me, jeez. I know you love me, but gosh. Contain yourself. Whoop. Hello. None of that. Okay. Yeah, no, let's just... That was a very, very good uh, explosion there. Very happy with that. Read? West, Tempest Mines, Tempest Mines, because we're on the plains right now, right? The Tempest Plains. So where does this go? Just back right over there? What do you got? Ragnarite? Well, uh, I can destroy that. Ooh, okay, game did not like me doing that, jeez. Okay, I don't have a key, right? Let's just make sure. Yeah, I need one. Oh, that's a different kind of key than the ones I normally get, isn't it? It has like a weird ring thing around it, but maybe that's just the key on the key ring. Maybe it's the same one I've been getting. The one I've been getting is just like a silver key or something, right? Give me that HP. Gotta destroy those lanterns and torches. Get that get that free Castlevania HP. No wall chicken though. Like actual healing item wall chicken. We have things hidden in walls, but we don't have wall chicken straight up. Oh hey! Oh, did you see the little scratch? It did the little scratch! That was adorable. Yeah, I killed a few of you earlier. Hi. Oh, are you pissed? Okay, I guess you are. Uh-huh. Uh. Okay, that didn't work. Well, that did. Uh-huh. Yeah, you want some of this? Yeah? Okay, you weren't so bad. Alright, well, you died. I don't know what that did for me, but, uh... Cool, I guess. Very, very cool, I guess. Yeah, I feel like I was gonna say something earlier, but I totally forgot. Brain is hard sometimes to keep track of everything. I do this all the time in real life, too. I'll just be talking or having a conversation, and I'll very quickly forget what I was going to say. It's a problem. Thing. But not one I can solve. Boom. Out of here. I'm not dealing with that. Ooh, health potion. Finally, another one of those. Um, there we are. Cool. And another one of these, finally. Oh, whoop. Whoop. Okay, I screwed that up. Everything about that was a mistake. Uh-huh. Whoop. I hit the ground, I think, there. Oh, that sucks. Smack. Give me this weird fruit. This is a long map. Jeez. 33% of the map filled in. We do have the complete other direction of uh, the planes as well to uh, keep in mind. Ooh, Hafen Pendant, an insignia proudly worn by Hafen City Guards. I would lo love to get to like a, a shop or wherever I can upgrade my stuff. That would be amazing. I would like to get to that someday. All right, so are you better than what I had before? Let's, let's just go over here and look at it this way. MP plus 5. Okay, it lowers my attack damage, which I'm not crazy about. That arachnid pendant was a good drop that I got. I haven't ever gotten another one either. Okay, fighting you when I'm above you is kind of obnoxious. Not gonna lie. Okay, one of them's dead. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Just keep baiting you like this. There we are. Uh-huh. Alright, this isn't so bad. 
I kind of got messed up there for a second, but now we're fine. Cool. Wish you would drop some more HP, though. Unless there's a heal spot, save point over here. Map maker? There is one here, luckily. Scribbles. Can't quite make out this path. This other one leads to... Yes, how can I... Ah, yeah, I knew you'd return. Yes, you thought always return after putting me aside. Oh, I could have sworn you went in the other direction. Anyway, the important thing is that you've reconsidered and returned for my maps. This old dog can still be useful, yes? Yep, the map maker. As I've already told you, i love to hand them out for free, but if I want to keep helping stray travelers like you, I can't afford it. Cool. Purchase map? Hell yeah, we're about to do that. Not easy making these maps. Every time I travel the plains, I find new paths. Keep that in mind, yeah? Uh, okay. Purchase map. 250 so yeah, this is what I want my money for. Cool. Uh, I don't think I have anything for it. So this is just the planes. So I gotta find you at each area and you'll probably give me stuff, right? Or, or give me a map of that area. So I need to find you in the caves. Find it especially for you, see? Here it is, scribbles. That should keep you from getting lost. You should know that my memory isn't what it once was. So you might come across routes on your own, yeah? Onwards, Tin Man. I'm not Tin, I'm wearing robes. Okay, whatever. So... Wait, so you've revealed the entire map to me, right? That's it? Everything I'm seeing here, are, I can already see myself. Unless it's the other Temp's Plains that we went to. Maybe that was it? Okay, and we're about to leave now. Well, there's apparently uh, two of those bugs hiding and six more treasure chests. I know where one of the bugs is, but I don't know where the other one is. Oh well, probably not something worth worrying about right now. Let's go ahead and activate this. And hit the save point. Oh. Cool. Alright, so... What do I want to do now? Um... Anything I care about looking at here? There's probably some new stuff in my bestiary and stuff, yeah. Alright, who we got? Scribble probably just got added. Scribbles, there we go. Scribbles is a Canaan... Canem explorer like no other. Much of his youth revolved around treasure hunting, though he never actually took what he found. His true passion was drawing, the paths he traveled to get there. He has spent his whole life finding the wonders of his world until, in the end, due to old age, his eyesight betrayed him while on a cliff, which brought Terragaya, a true veteran, in his field. He's a little absent-minded, but his talent is rivaled by no other. Okay, that's all the characters. Bestiary Mini Slime. Many slimes are, as their appearance suggests, pieces left behind by their older relatives. So not exactly a reproductive method, but a form of division, since the original slime reduces its size so that its new being can move on its own. Many slimes are full of energy and do not stop moving, restlessly attacking almost anything they come across. Okay, well we're filling in those things. Stone golem. These golems are made of inanimate rocks bound together with a soul by a spell. No matter where they come from, they obey the being who created them. Typically, they are given a basic task, which in most cases consists of attacking, as they were primarily used in battles before being discarded. Weak to wind. Kobolds! Ah, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Kobolds are small, dog-like creatures that generally prefer looting and pillaging over peaceful coexistence. Gangs of pillagers take advantage of them with promises of easy gold and silver, using them as direct bait on the roads to take whatever they can. Once they spot their target, they harass them with their hammers until they get something of value. A Valyrian. These birds usually live around high peaks, but it is not uncommon to find them flying over the fields of Terragaya during certain periods of the year in search of food and materials. When something catches their attention, they carefully scan their surroundings for any dangers before swooping down repeatedly until finishing off their prey. Yep, I have noticed that. Um, so is there anything else here? I don't- this- this should all be bosses mostly, right? Uh, wait, what is this? Oh wait, no, this is new. Yeah, 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 you. A microbial organism took this form when it felt threatened. It looks similar to flying insects, but something about its behavior does not seem entirely normal. Its true origin is wrapped in... mystery. So yeah, you're the little purple orb we see floating around and possessing things. So you're a parasite. Alright, that makes sense. Um, where's my new thing here? Neosorb map. Inescapable hit, yeah. Stay alert. Okay, we know about those. 
Gotta remember that stuff. I do refresh myself on most of these tutorials um, at the beginning of each episode. It's it's just it's nice when games have tutorials like that that I can use to refresh. Um, if we end the episode off now, I think it's going to be a little bit short. So how we move ahead just a little bit more? Once I get like a, a new ability, I'll definitely go back and re-explore a bunch of these areas to see some of the things I may have missed. Because I'm sure I have missed some things. But I want a new ability first. Because I feel like that just make it easier. It feels like this is going to be an area where fire is going to be useful. Okay, I can destroy the like weird lanterns. Very pretty. Okay. Little, little fox ranger hanging out here. You're cool. Hello. I do like the look of you. Oh my god, that's a lot of healing down there. Jeez. Okay, thank you. Okay, that's a cool enemy. So we got another one of those to check out. Probably when I hit the next checkpoint, we'll end the episode off for today. What was that? Hi. Uh-huh. Well, you're very obnoxious. There we go. No. Stop that. Alright, I need to get across to that treasure chest, which means I gotta get up there and then walk all the way to the left. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, bing, bing. Whoop. Okay, you died. Good stuff. Okay, we still gotta get up top. Get me up top. There we go, finally. Now I can walk all the way over there. I don't need that HP. Who cares? Bust everything up, why don't we? We. And we. Oh, you're following me really far. Jeez. You follow crazy far. Hello. You walking back? You turned your back to me, fool. Okay. You you come down a lot faster here because the ceiling is so low. That's a funny detail. Yeah, your helm splitter comes down so much faster because you bonk your head on the ceiling. Craziness. Alright. Can I... Ooh. Oh, I can't climb that. Aw, oh, come on. I mean, I know it's a small rope, but it's still a rope. I should be able to climb it. Oh, I can't get up here this way. There we are. Yeah, I like this area. It has like a, a fairy forest aesthetic. I, got, I like the big trees and everything in the background as well. Bye-bye, dorks. Um, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Ooh, just had a potion. I can't carry any more of that potion because I never use that kind. <laughs> Well, that sucks. Yeah, I just never super feel the need, I guess, but... I don't know, I should I should prioritize it a bit more. Okay. Um, here you go. Enjoy. Uh-huh. Yeah, that, that was a well-placed bomb. I'm very happy with that bomb, actually. <laughs> that, that might have saved me a lot of HP, because there were two of them. And two of them is spooky. Two of them at a time. All right, over here. Um. Ah, damn it, that's hard to reach. Uh, let's give it another shot. I'm confident that I can hit it, otherwise why is it there? There we go, one of those. Ah, that's a good old health potion. That is much more useful than the other one, because I actually use those. It just refills my mana, which, I don't know, I should use them in boss fights because It'll allow me to just spam my powerful mana attacks. But, uh... Okay, you fired way faster than I thought you were. Whoop! Okay. Yep, you keep firing faster than I think you're going to. Should I... I should drop down and grab that just in case it's HP. It was not. At least there's a lot of things to refill my HP with here. Give me more of that. Thought I was maybe going to be able to go in some of these houses, but nope. Doesn't seem like I'm that lucky. Give Asgarite shiny mineral used for powering all kinds of weapons. Am I going to get different weapons over the course of this game? What, what's the deal? What's what's the what's the news on that? What's the deets on that? Uh, okay. You're. I tried to roll around you, and you dashed backwards and shot me in the face. Cause you're kind of an asshole. <sighs> that sucks. That really, really sucks. Oh my god, I gotta redo all of that too. Where are my checkpoints? 
Jesus, fuck, I thought this game had checkpoints. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna have to redo all of that. I didn't know there was going to be an enemy in there. Or, you know, I would have been a bit safer. But, uh, that was my bad. Alright, uh, this is where I left off before, right? I think so. I got these Asgarites and then went down here. Yeah. Alright, I think this is where we left off. Yeah, because down here's where shit goes down. Why are you hiding down here? Little idiot. Alright, we're gonna drink. Alright, let's be a little bit safer this time. Let's go ahead and put that down, because I know you're over here. Oh my god! Uh, okay, you resist fire? Uh-huh. Boom. God, that time you died. Jeez. Weird bastard. Alright, what does this do? This is just a shortcut, it seems. I mean, it does make it easier to, you know, get through this whole area, I suppose. Didn't like that enemy. That enemy is mean. A bully. Don't like them. No bully. Alright, well, I had to use a healing potion for that, but whatever. It's, it's fine. I didn't die again, and that's the important part. Because having to redo everything is rough. Okay, you're dead. Thank you. Nothing in here, really. Just your little hidey hole. Good to know. I guess I should try to jump in stumps when, uh, ever I see them, huh? I feel like I have seen some other stumps and I don't think I tried jumping in them, so... Maybe that's something I should do. Um, I don't like that you exist. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, bing, bing. Uh, uh, okay, I exploded you. Good. Alright, you want some? Let's go. Uh-huh. Whoop. Don't grab that, please. Okay, come down here. This is the better spot to fight, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come over here. Hey, you want some? Uh-huh. Come on. Want some more? Uh-huh. You're just gonna run away, huh? You use your power of flight to... Huh. Okay. Uh-huh. Whoop! I didn't mean to grab that ledge. Grabbing ledges is gonna get me killed so often, just saying. Whoop. Thought my thing was off cool down there, it was not. Huh. Stupid ledge grabs. Huh. They're a blessing and a curse. Alright. Let's go ahead and grab some more of this stuff, because there's more junk down here. Huh. I hate seeing even more of you. Just don't like these doofuses. Yeah, drop down here, idiot. There you go. Enjoy! Uh-huh. Dead. Yeah, you like that? You got bombs? I got bombs too. Dork. Eat shit. Huh. And I just got all my bombs refunded. See, that's why we use bombs. I'm gonna get them refunded anyway. Cool. Uh-huh. Whoop. Nope. Uh, not enough mana. Damn. Uh, whoop. I was trying to block there. Uh-huh. You're dead, finally. Okay. Now I can worry about you. Jeez. Oh, there's one of those thingies. Right there, I see that. Give me this. Ooh, soul ring. The last hopes of some poor soul were sealed inside this ring. Okay, that's a new piece of equipment, right? So, protects the user from death before disintegrating. Uh, oh, and I didn't even notice that extra effect on the half and pendant. Plus 8% healing effects. That's pretty good. I still don't know if it's worth the loss in attack, but that is cool. Um, I didn't, I didn't notice that extra effect there. I was just looking at the stats last time, so... Well, it's good to know that things can have extra effects like that. That is very useful to know. Hey, doofus. Remember me? Ow. Apparently you do. Can you die, please? Thank you. I took damage there when I really shouldn't have. But, uh, I expected to be able to kill you faster. Really need to find some damage upgrades. <laughs> really, really need to find those badly. Alright, let's just, uh, 
safely get out of here, why don't we? So there was an area over here to the left. There's you, but... Damn it. I can't reach you right now. Because I can't get up that high. A constant struggle. Alright, well, we're fine. We can save the game now, so... Yep, I think that's a good sized episode of Soldiers, so... I think we'll probably go ahead and look at our bestiary here and then end things off. Go ahead and check out these new thingies. What do we got? Um, not you. Probably something that's going to come up here. It's the, it's the, yeah, you two. Rainus and Red Rainus. Rainus are intelligent creatures that bide their time in forests. Their goal, unsurprisingly, is none other than ambushing. They also tend to carefully observe from above, waiting to ambush with their threatening bows. Their dexterity is not something to be taken lightly, as they tend to be elusive against direct attacks and later strike with lightning speed. Yeah, I've noticed. Red Rainus, the more belligerent and cunning of their peers, coordinate all plans carried out by the forest bandits. They carefully calculate the time and place where their victims will be attacked. Red Rainus carry explosive arrows and use their agility to fire them quickly from above. I thought I thought that meant it was like ability. I, I read that as ability the first time, so I was confused. Um, making them very dangerous adversaries. Yeah, I've also noticed that. Okay, I think that's everything. Yep, we're good. So, all right. Hope you've enjoyed this episode of Soldiers, and I'll see you next time for some more.